how many hearts we're getting. We're not one-shotting the... Man, dude. The golems, which is a little bit of a bummer. Definitely not getting a lot of XP, so I'll have to come back to this one. Gold, we're up to 11 gold, which is not a lot of gold. Okay, I definitely need to be more cognizant of... Um, basically how much damage we're doing. Because we're not um, one-shotting stuff, so I'm going to get hit. Oh, yo, yo, everybody, what's going on? It's Lodi's here, back with another Nordic Ashes run. And we're going to see how this one goes today. Hopefully, y'all have enjoyed the content. If so, make sure you just tap that like button down below. It also shows 99% of you guys are not subscribed, so make sure you guys tap that subscribe button. I greatly appreciate it. And uh, if you guys end up enjoying Make sure you guys tap that like button. Uh, let's jump right on into this. And uh, we're going to play Hansi once again. Um, we do have one point. One plus one red heart. After using a dash, it has a 50% chance of resetting. We're going to go with red heart. And we are going to try a deep crystal today. And <clears throat> we're going to see how this goes. Hopefully it goes pretty well. Um, it's supposed to spawn a pool underneath. So we'll see. We are going to play it on uh, hard mode. So, well... We'll see how that goes. So hopefully we can uh, knock it out of the park with no problem. There's also a crossbow at some point. We, maybe we'll try crossbow today as well, but we will see. So yeah, we do spawn, it looks like pools, two pools. So this one's gonna, I feel like be a little little tough. Um, well, this look like it, it does look like it targets the enemies first. Um, I was going to say, if it just randomly spawns the pools, we're going to have a little bit of a problem. But it does look like it, it, they, they spawn underneath um, enemies, so that should, be, that should be pretty good. We'll see how this goes. We'll see how this goes. Doesn't look too bad right now. Five for five damage, minus 2%, 2.5 movement speed, that's not too bad. Uh, this will be a big one for XP wise, okay. Not bad. Not bad. Effect props, I believe that's what this one is. We'll come down here, we'll grab this. Not sure how this will go, but um, hopefully it's a pretty decent um, upgrade. Um, okay, we're looking good so far. We do got 13 points. Let's uh, grab some of this and see what we got going on here. So, critical, I do want more projectiles, I do want more than two, but let's see. In addition to damaging enemies, the Shadow Pools slow them down and deal 7.9 damage every 90 minutes, 0. 0.91 seconds. Okay, that's not too bad. Um, let's grab you. Duration, sure. This is where I want projectiles. Okay, I guess, there we go. Ooh, more area could be pretty, pretty big too. Um, that could, that could probably help out quite a bit, actually. Um, definitely take more projectile, more area. Definitely cool down to... Okay. How big are... Pools aren't that big, but having multiple pools is definitely way nicer. You got like five. It'll also be pretty crazy when we go and fight the boss. The amount of pools that spawn, um, will be pretty crazy. We do got the souls as well. Okay. Let's make our way over towards some of these other ones. I mean, more cooldown. Yeah, I can't say no to more cooldown. Um, the pools do seem pretty good, though. Pools do seem pretty good. Ooh, this could be good, too. The distraction. Um, which could be cool. Or, I guess, the attraction uh, totem. Ragdoll here. Doesn't seem too bad. Um, damage would be nice to increase. I do like that it slows too, but I mean, da more damage could be cool. Uh, we do have crit going for our, uh, the two shadow orbs around us, which is pretty good. Um, okay, not too bad, not too bad. Um, let's see, let's continue grabbing these. Let's make our way down here to the, uh, blue, um, one for our points. Okay, plus one damage, 10 attack speed. Yeah, I'll take that. Why not? More damage. Can't say no to more damage. Okay, two blue hearts. So the attack speed is how quickly... 
we spawn them, it looks like. Okay. Ooh, that guy's a little quick. Okay. Doesn't look too bad, doesn't look too bad. Alright, not bad, not bad, not bad. Okay. 17 more kills. Which we're looking good so far. And boom, we got it. Okay, that's two extra. Um, oh, and then we just got the uh, the stone up here, it looks like. So we'll see what uh, this has for us. We do got 11 points, so nothing too bad. Ooh, okay, almost got a hit there. So we walked right in. Uh, bread, adds full one red heart container. Okay, so we got a good chunk of hearts going on for us right now. Okay, not too bad. The red crows definitely... Yeah. So we lost one of our uh, shadow orbs there. Not the end of the world. Okay, uh, we definitely need more going here. Uh, cooldown could be good. Ooh, damage for sure. But I kind of want damage and projectiles. I, I need, yeah, there we go. Okay. I guess we'll take what we got for right now. All right. I do like... Okay, damage is definitely doing work now. We are back to one-shotting everything, it looks like. I believe we are one-shotting... Eh, we're like two-shotting the Red Crows, so nothing too crazy there. But we are... We are killing them pretty quickly. We are killing them pretty quickly. So not too bad. Not too bad. Alright. Dang, that actually hit us? I, that's actually surprising. Well, we lost our two Shadow Orbs. A little bit of a bummer there, but not the end of the world. I believe the shadow orbs just uh, increases our ultimate. Is chance of dropping a shadow orb that stays on the ground for 10 seconds. Shadow orb grants crit chance up to five, which is what? 15, 30, 60, what is that? 75 crit? That's actually, that's actually quite a bit. Um, okay. More damage. Definitely want projectile and damage, I feel like. Are the ones that I really, really, really want. Um, I can see the boss being a little bit of a struggle. Um, well, I mean, if we get all five to spawn underneath the boss, I don't think it'll be too bad. But we'll we'll see. Um, if we can get another one along with more damage, I think we'll be okay. I think I think we'll be okay. So we'll see there. Also, if we could get more shadow orbs, that could be huge. Um, like if we could get up to the five shadow orbs, that would be that'd be actually insane. Because that would be 75 crit, which means we'd be critting like almost every single time, which could be insane. But we'll we'll just have to see. We'll just have to see. So far, so good though. I don't see us doing too bad. Okay. Lots of XP down here. Okay. Still looking good. Got to remember, bosses will do one heart of damage to us, so got to be careful there. Okay. I mean, we we melted that uh, that the elite pretty quick, so we are doing good damage. Nothing too crazy though. Nothing too crazy. Um, I'll just grab all the XP now because we might we might get a good chunk down on him. Um, ooh, almost took that. Um. I do want more projectiles. Yeah, perfect. Projectiles and damage. And then this one, I definitely want projectiles and damage as well. So 12 projectiles doing 63 to 68 damage. Projectile speed, I don't think we necessarily need. More cooldown, though, would be super nice. Um, chance you have above 100% will become damage. I mean, right now we have 5% plus, plus 2.5 here. So this, I don't think it'll be worth it. Projectile speed, we don't really necessarily need. Maybe we will take it just to get to um, Shadow Archer appears from your character shooting arrows at your enemy. So it almost seems like these two could be very good and maybe these two could be very good. But um, we will take this just to um, get the upgrade for um, the uh, just the ascension to get the extra ascension. Crap, dude, we got hit, man. Gotta be careful, I can't get hit. Okay. I mean, we, we, we did melt it pretty quick, to be honest with you. Yeah, we melted it pretty dang quick. 
So, holy cow, we actually got a, quite a bit of points there. 15, I was not expecting that many points. Um, adds one full red heart container and a blue heart, I'll take. Plus 50 gold? I probably should have took this first, that's a bit of a bummer, because now we can't get either of those. Dang. That sucks. Um, dang. Alright, well, let's take this. Um, increase the damage you deal to bosses by 15%. Um, maybe? Minions and elites die when you have... I mean, this one is so good, though. So good, though. Um, cooldown and critical. What is this? Your shadow archers perform a second attack in all directions. Okay. So, sure, cooldown. I don't really care about duration, I guess. Ooh, projectiles and damage is good. Cooldown and damage is good. Projectile and crit, sure. Um, I don't care. Yeah, there we go. Um, I think we should go into cooldown first. Okay. A little bit of a bummer we can't pick up um, any of those. I should have picked up the gold first. I should have looked how much gold we had, but I, I didn't. Um, ooh, Archer seems very... I think Archer's pretty good. Archer could be very useful if we run daggers with it. I think Archer could be phenomenal. Okay. Yeah, we're looking pretty good right now. I'm not too, too worried about any of this. Okay, we got, uh, we got the movement speed, so let's run over here, see what we got for this. Ooh, this is one we have not seen yet. So let me get some XP. I don't remember how much it is. I think it's five. Yep, five. Okay. Um, adds two full red heart containers. Oh, wow. Okay. Okay, this would actually be super good if we had Helga, if we were running Helga this run. Because of how many hearts we're getting. We're not one-shotting the... Man, dude. The golems, which is a little bit of a bummer. Definitely not getting a lot of XP, so I'll have to come back to this one. Gold, we're up to 11 gold, which is not a lot of gold. Okay, I definitely need to be more cognizant of um, basically how much damage we're doing. Because we're not um, one-shotting stuff, so I'm going to get hit. Or I'm going to end up walking into um, stuff. Ooh, 15 gold for that guy, which we don't have enough of yet. And that one... I think it's pretty good if I remember. Lightning bolts from the sky dealing damage can paralyze all enemies that it hits. Yes. That is pretty good. 19 gold. So I'm going to come down here. I'm going to grab you real quickly. Okay. We're looking pretty good right now. Now if we can just get some more XP. We'll be looking really good. Um, you know what? Let's just stick to cooldown. And then probably damage. Um, I know I really want to get the... Um, XP points for whatchamacallit, but that's okay. Okay. So we're not doing too bad. I mean, we're surviving right now. Um, what else? Oh, we got this other altar over here, it looks like. So we'll go see what's on this one. We are very slow. Gotta take that into consideration. We are very slow. Um, area damage. Ooh, duration. I'll take duration. Means that's on the ground quick longer, I believe. Okay, more gold. Not bad. So I like the puddles, but they're not... They're not spawning to where, like, I would like them to spawn. Which is a little bit of a bummer. That's okay. I mean, we're still doing good work. Um, we're not, we're still not getting, like, a whole lot of XP. Like, we're getting a good chunk, but not, um, like, we're not leveling up as quickly as I would like. Okay. I mean, we are at level 62 already, which is pretty gnarly. So we're doing okay. Um, okay. Ooh, this one is, adds two empty red heart containers. Okay. So, we could get potentially four extra hearts, which could be absolutely insane. Um, on top of what, the five, six, seven and a half we have now, as long as we don't get hit and lose our blue hearts, um, we'll be looking really good. <clears throat> I mean, we're not doing too bad right now. This build, I could definitely see you being able to potentially end up standing still with it. Um, as long as the puddles land and like, 
the optimal like positions, but so far not uh, not <laughs> super great. I mean, don't get me wrong, we're still doing pretty dang good. And we're melting the uh, boss of the elites. Um, cooldown could be huge. Cause like the quicker we can spawn our puddles, I feel like it would be huge. Okay, we do have seven points, so we can go up to that altar. Ooh, I do want to make it to the, the mine, though. I do want to try and make it over to the mine. And then make it up to that altar. Ah. Okay, we're capped out on the mine, so 12 gold. Luckily, we're stopping over here. Okay, and then I need to head straight down here. Okay, boom. 123, that's that's pretty good. Um, ah! Okay. Not too bad. It's straight down. We'll grab this guy. Boom. There we go. And then we'll come back up here. I don't remember where we killed... Ah, there, there they are. Because, like, I don't remember where we killed the elites, but we definitely need that XP. Um, okay. So this could actually be huge. Increase the damage you deal to bosses. Um, I definitely want to increase this. Okay, I'll take that. Um... Fifteen percent, or seven point five percent or less of their total health. <clears throat> I mean, that just makes them die, so I think we should definitely take that. I mean, the boss damage could be good, too. But I mean, like... Like, we're not killing them super quickly. But we are doing pretty good. Okay. There's so much XP around, but we're not, like... We're not picking it up very fast. Okay. Yeah, we're not melting him very quickly. Oh, that actually hit us? Come on, man. Okay, we are very slow, though. Taking that one that bumped us down to, like, 15% is actually kind of crazy. We're not 15%. Um, bumped uh, 0.25 off. Like, I didn't realize how much that was actually going to take off of our movement speed, but holy smokes, are we slow. We are very slow. Ooh, that was a close one. And he's dead. Heck yeah, dude. Heck yeah, dude. Okay, 23 gold. I definitely want... Ooh, legendary one. Increase this cooldown 100% per unused ascension crystal. Plus a zero. Plus one ascension crystal. This is how we got our fourth ascension crystal before. Because it gives us another ascension crystal. So I'm totally going to take that. Push all enemies away from you. Each item has been okay. Grants a blue heart and breaks when you okay. I'll take this one. And I'll take this one. Okay, so we got eleven points. I'll take this. And ooh, that's a perfect one. Okay. And I think I'll take more into cooldown. So this is where are you? Oh, there you are. You only have one crystal enhancer. So we got... Holy cow, we got plus 200% cooldown. That is actually absurd. That is absurd. Holy smokes, dude. Alright. <laughs> okay. That is actually crazy. So we should be spawning these almost... Oh my god, dude. Yeah, we're spawning them almost constantly now. So this is insane. This is an amazing item. Crit duration? I'll take duration. Holy cow. So we almost constantly have them... Okay, this is the most insane relic ever. What relic is this? Cooldown Crystal Enhancer. Oh my god. This is insane. So we have 230 
cooldown. Imagine if we didn't use our enhance our uh, ascension crystals, we'd have 400% cooldown. <laughs> oh my god, dude, this is crazy. This is crazy. My goodness, dude. Oh, we missed the uh, the crit. Uh, the shadow orb. Dang it, man. Okay, this is this is absolutely wild. Okay, let's grab you. See how this goes. This shouldn't be too bad. Hmm. Uh, let's do area. This could be good. I don't know how that affects. I do like the more movement speed, though. I feel like I could pick up more XP for the movement speed, which is very, very good. Very good. Okay. Oh, we have another one down here. I'm sure it's going to be like five or seven experience points, which we're not getting a whole lot of experience points right now, so I got to be careful on what I buy. Seven, and it gives us an extra dash. Okay, okay. <clears throat> not too bad. Um, I don't know if I necessarily... I mean, the dash, the double dashes actually could be pretty good. So maybe I will end up taking it. Yeah, yeah, I think I'm gonna take it because during the boss fights, it'll be, it'll be useful to get, um, to have double dashes for it. So I think I'm definitely gonna end up taking it. Just as, like, a, um, safety precaution. Okay, there we go. We got the, the orb, but it doesn't matter, because if we get hit, we're done -zo. Okay. I mean, we're, we're shredding stuff, so we're getting tons and tons of XP, which is also very, very good. So, I mean, we'll see how that goes. Item attraction could be very good, but also area could be huge. Plus 10% area. Like, item attraction would be huge, but, like... The wave's almost done. Like, if this was wave one, and we got... Oh, it's item attraction, so it's not even XP attraction. So you know what? That would have been a waste if we took that. So luckily, we didn't take that. Because that would have been a huge waste. Um, I do want to try and get enough XP for the double dash. Oh, there we go. Okay, so now we have double dash. We do have a lot of XP going on. So I do want to try and at least maybe max out cooldown. And then maybe also try and get some points into damage, which could be huge. So we'll see about all of that. Um, I mean, we're doing pretty good. We are up to 5 XP. Not a lot of XP points, but we're trying. We're trying here. We're trying. Okay. Uh, let's see. Ooh, you know what? Let's take this one. Let's take this. And then we'll go into damage. Because, like, we're going to be fighting the boss here, so I might as well take it. Even though I really wanted the other one. Um, fighting the boss, it'll actually be very useful for. Um... I mean, don't get me wrong, the other one actually probably would have been super useful too for clearing out all the ads. But I mean, I don't know, we'll, we'll just we'll just see how things go, I guess. We'll see how things go, I guess. I don't know. Hopefully we shut him now. Okay, here we go, here we go, here we go. Hopefully we melt him as quickly as we did with the daggers. Um, okay, we melted him. Unfortunately, he hit his um, Im immortal zone, which is okay. I'm not too worried about that. We do have the puddles constantly spawning underneath him, though. Getting that cooldown um, crystal was absolutely massive. It w that that is literally a game changer for this. Like it, we're just insane with that. Okay, right, come on, come on, before- yeah, baby! Easy peasy, dude. Use the Deep Crystal Shadow Pool's Ascension. Use the Shadow Crossbow Spiral Arrow's Ascension. Heck yeah, dude. That was- that was another quick, quick kill. 
I definitely would say that was another quick kill. Along with, um, dude, that that relic definitely was an insane game changer. Like, holy smokes, dude. Holy smokes, dude. 663 on the crossbow. The crossbow did more than the deep crystal. Oh my gosh, we need to do just a crossbow run. But I do have to say, cooldown crystal enhancer, insane. We had over, we had 230% cooldown, over 200% cooldown, insane. All right, let's see what we got here. Not too bad, 179, not not super great, but not, not terrible. Um, area could be good. Duration, <clears throat> projectile speed could be a good one as well. Um, I think I need to go XP attraction though, just to be able to pick up more XP. If you guys did enjoy this, make sure you guys tap that like button down below. If you guys are new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. I'd greatly appreciate it if you join the club before a thousand, as that is our goal at the moment. Once again, thank you guys all for watching. This has been Nordic Ashes, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.